Welcome to video two of module five, have to and has to. In this video, I want to show you some little pronunciation tricks and tips to sound like a native talking about obligations with he and she. Let's go. Just like the last video, consider the difference between he or she has something and he or she has to to do something, right? Can you hear the pronunciation already? He or she has something and he or she has to do something. The same writing, different pronunciation, okay? So a job, do you have a job? He or she has a job or she or she, he or she has to, has to get a job. So can you see already here? He or she has to do it, but never he or she has to doing it. Just a basic uh, part of the form. Now, here, for example, just like the last video, if we have he or she has and a noun, noun can be time, money, a job, whatever. The H A S is a pronunci pronunciation of has, has. He or she has a job, has time. But he or she has to, and a verb, she has to, he has to, okay? So he or she has to plus verb, he or she has to find a job. He has to call me, right? Has to, he has to, she has to, okay? He or she has to do it, becoming he or she has to do it. Negative, he or she doesn't have, have to do it, okay? So in the negative, he or she does not, doesn't have to do it. So you need to be ready for the previous pronunciation as well in the negative. Of course, what happens? He or she doesn't have to do it. And he or she doesn't have to do it. Okay? These are the little pronunciation trips, tricks all about when we have the word have and to and a verb. And what happens? So let's start. Remember, has to and doesn't have to. He or she has to and doesn't have to. So pause the video, listen, repeat, and train your pronunciation. Ready? She has to be there really early tomorrow. She has to. She has to be there. Has to be there really early tomorrow. She does not have to do it if she does not want to. She doesn't have to do it if she doesn't want to. What happens next? She doesn't have to do it. She does not have to do it. She doesn't have to do it. She doesn't have to do it if she doesn't want to. She doesn't have to do it if she doesn't want to. She has to be there really early tomorrow to be ready for the interview. She has to be there really early tomorrow to be ready for the interview. She has to be there. She has to be there really early to be ready for the interview. She has to be there really early to be ready for the interview. To be ready for the interview. He has to show you what to do when you get there. He has to show you what to do when you get there. He has to show you what to do when you get there. So he has to show you, he has to show you. He has to show you what to do, what to do, what to do when you get there. He has to show you what to do when you get there. He is happy because he does not have to work tomorrow.
He's happy because he doesn't have to work tomorrow. He's happy so because he cause he. He's happy because he doesn't have to work tomorrow. He's he's happy because he doesn't have to work tomorrow. Because he doesn't have to work tomorrow. He has to book the flight really soon to be able to come with us. He has to book, he has to book the flight really soon to be able to come with us. And he has to book the flight really soon to be able to come with us. To be able to come with us. So this ends our video two on has to and has to. I will see you in the next video when I will talk to you about the past with had to and had to. See you there.